Yeah, this is the Lake uh, Nungchok. Forgive me if I pronounce it totally wrong, but. <laughs> Uh, and you can see here, it's uh, like uh, you can go and uh, rent uh, jet ski and uh, boat and uh, swimming and have and enjoy the time in the war if you if you if you if you so like. And you have like um, like dining area, food and cafe and everything here also. So uh, I will for sure have some coffee and, and some food here later on, but not now. I will walk around now. And uh, this is the car I arrived here today, uh, a static car, it uh, took us around one hour to go and it was really, really tough on the car, I believe, <laughs> because it has so much camber, as you can, as you can see. Not the easy ride for a car, but very fun though. we actually go this direction first on the upper side here and uh, well as you can imagine this is the entrance for the course and the Honda Accord never seen this kind of Honda Accord with uh, I don't think so anyway. <laughs> the combi. Alena? Uh, this uh, BMW we actually seen before. Really nice color. It's wrapped, I believe, for sure, but this, I like uh, the style of this one. Okay, now here we have some regular, I'm not sure this is part of the exhibition or not. Uh, maybe not, because they have a jet ski here. But here we have Mazda, Mazda 2. Honda, I believe you will see a lot of Hondas here. <laughs> Typical stance fitment car. Nice color on this one. This is from uh, Europe. And another Honda. Not sure what the price of the Honda is right now, but I believe the, the small hatchback Honda from uh, ED or EF, they call they they super expensive here now but uh, these four doors I'm not sure because I tend to see them a lot there compared to previous year maybe I'm only me who looking for them too car and we have a Z nice Yakuza.
ัวผมไม่ได้ไม่ได้โอ้ยซีทูร์บอร์ชอร์ชบริเวณเอลซีรีส Badass. And this is not uh, super much cameras. I think actually this can be pretty fast on the on the on the street. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's street traced this one. Not not really on the track. I believe you will not see it, but I'm pretty sure we'll see it on the street. Interesting. This one. Can't decide if I like it or not, but it's uh, a little bit different than my so I guess I like it. Horus. This one here is from uh, the same group I arrived here with, and this is actually a case swap and uh, turbo charge. This one, it's uh, also not. A lot of uh, camber in this in this uh, form and setup as for now, and I believe it's not uh, gonna have it. It's it's not a track. The car is more like a street daily street race, so to say. Uh, you might maybe see it on the on the drag strip, but I will doubt, doubt that you see it on the on the on the track, but. I'm not sure how. Oh, oh this is the my group. <laughs> they will tent there tonight, so they will actually spend the night in this area. I will go back to Bangkok because I'm not up to for camping. Also, what I really enjoy is you, you can have like uh, the car meeting series like for everyone. You see like family and everything. So it's even if if people drink it, it's not like the same as they they behave badly. So it's pretty chill everything. That's maybe they call fit men and chill. So <laughs> right, let's have a look at this one. Might uh, actually just be painted stuff inside it. I'm not sure it's actually done so much. But if you like it, you might like this one. This was a really cool color in this one. And. Actually, let me show this one. This guy here, I believe I met him uh, maybe 10 years ago and I had a ride in this one. He was in the same car group called, uh, well, I don't remember the group, what his name was, but he gave me a ride anyway, so it's uh, really cool. 
cool little Civic. And uh, also think this was, if I remember, it was a B engine in this one, so B16 maybe. Right. Oh, this low core. Civic. I would love to have one of these. Or maybe actually some type R. Big question, type R or M4? Which one would you prefer? I'm a Honda guy, but I think M4 is maybe a little bit more to have fun around with. Here we have the two cars arrive uh, when we start this uh, vlog, so we can just make a, a quick flyby. Oh, wow, this upgraded. Hey, this might actually be one of my older friends from Thai. I know he actually recently bought a DC5 that he started to fix up. Uh, there's not that many DC5 in China, so I mean, the chances this is his is it can be from. Uh, if, if it's the guy is from uh, PMC Motorsport, which I Motorsport, but I'm not sure it's him. But I hope it's him because I actually want to see how he did the setup in the front suspension in his car. Uh, since I'm rebuilding my DC5 right now, so would be interesting. We will have a closer look in that one after, but we continue. And here we have. Nice. We can't have a look at this one, so I think this guy will be happy if he... <laughs> Take a look at it. E30. Uh, they was um, pretty affordable before in, in Sweden, but now the price on them start to rise. So I think uh, even if they look cool and, and uh, had the decent price before now, I think it's a bit too much price to what you price performance range anyway. Uh, this one here, similar as I had once, uh, but I'm pretty sure this is a B engine swap, and, or maybe not swap, maybe actually it's an EF, but it's a um, pretty sure it's B engine. And if I think it's the car that I'm thinking, so that's uh, also from uh, uh, former PMC Motorsport, PMC Motorsport. Uh, Civic. I think his uh, wife actually owned this car once, but I'm not sure this, this is the one, but um, it looks similar in a way from the picture I've seen from, from when they had it before in a way, so. Take a look. Or Tripper 8. Toyota. This is actually one of my 
dream car. I kind of regret I sold uh, sold my old Civic. And I kind of also regret that I gave my CRX away that I once had. Not as good looking as this one though, but I had had one. Didn't make many miles in my ownership though. Beautiful and beautiful. Very beautiful. <laughs> Benz. Maybe I go from the other side so we don't see my shadow. From the same group as I arrived with also. Okay, this uh, is like the end of, uh, of the exhibition area for a car, so we go back and look at the other side. And uh, yeah, this one here is also from the same gang I was riding with today, so I believe uh, the owner of this are actually is in Korat, and uh, he took the car to the garage in here in Bangkok to make the camber because this uh, garage here in, is how say maybe one of the leading garage to make big camber more than 10 degree in a way so I think it's not sure how many degree this one is but way more than 10 anyway This uh, Nissan I have had in my previous vlogs a few times and photo shoot and everything super nice. More a show car than a drift car, even if pretty sure you can drift this. Right, right. No, I'm a Honda, Honda guy.
we have to go back and look at this one because I saw some really cool uh, engine work in that one, so let's go. swap turbo charge not the small turbo one this is some serious uh, machine Take it, one more look. Alright, I believe uh, this one could be actually super fast on the drag strip if it's it's too incorrect and they have uh, the correct wheel alignments because now it's too much camber on it but really cool built car I think super badass <laughs> okay let's uh, continue So stop the engine this one to a beam sending. Super super clean.
Oh, it's okay, don't worry, it's okay. It's a little bit uh, yeah. rough because of the low car. But it's okay. Come on! Okay, then. I'll, I'll take okay. some yeah. clip. Yes. And then we go green over there. Alright, okay. Yeah. Uh, one of uh, the guys I met many, many years ago. And then uh, we added each other in Facebook, but we didn't actually talk for a few years. And then uh, last year, I asked him if there was some kind of car meeting, and he invited me last year. And uh, I started to hang out with his gang, uh, Manacol Lifestyle. I, I cannot pronounce it, but okay, you understand what I mean. Facebook is actually pretty good in this, because you can get and keep a connection in a way you didn't do before. Um, I remember when there wasn't any Facebook when I had email and basically all all my contact I gained over all my traveling and tried to still have connection in email they kind of faded away so so in that way Facebook is great I think although I know that uh, they say Facebook is for older people now that it's not for a young one. <laughs> Short Civic. I would love to see the under hood in this one, but well, maybe next time. And here we have BMW S202, I believe they call it. I'm not really sure now if I say the correct number. And we have one Beetle over here. on the Subaru CGA was uh, pretty common in Sweden 10 years ago but now they kind of faded away I guess they rusted away so rumble I love the hanging rumble from the EGs in, in the Subarus Nice. And this one here looks like a, a street racer. Might actually be a track or so. Okay, here's the car I arrived with, and uh, we're basically back from where we started. We can go just over here and have a look. Pretty fun event. You have like core meeting, you have food, you have drink, you have uh, war sports and everything. So. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I call we do a little bit more vlogging over here and then we wrap it up for today, I think. Uh, 
I will try to find some coffee because Thai coffee is possibly the best coffee I think. And uh, I will eat also. We'll for sure eat here. It's food there. Alright. Let's make one more run, run, run walk, walk through and then we finish. Uh, I hope you will enjoy this vlog and uh, I hope it actually come out good. Uh, a little bit, how to say, concerned about the audio in this uh, camera just now because I'm, sometimes I think it's kind of fading away or sometimes it's, uh, how to say, wrong sound. It's like a uh, noisy sound, so I, I hope uh, everything works, but we see. This is the uh, same group as I come to, I think they take selfies. So.